This is Human Geography 442 at the University of Oregon. But this course's primary text isn't like most classes. This America, man. HBO's The Wire. <laughs> Set in the city of Baltimore is one of the most critically acclaimed TV shows of all time. It is also the text for this class. This is Dr. Katie Meehan a geography professor at the University of Oregon, who is the professor of this class, which she first taught at the University of Arizona. So how did she come up with the idea for the class? The idea from this class first came when I was a graduate student at the University of Arizona in Tucson. And while I was doing my dissertation work in Mexico, a friend forwarded me some copies of The Wire, and I think I watched the whole series in like three months, every night four hours at a time in the middle of the night on my laptop and I thought this is the greatest series on all the urban issues of the world that I've ever seen and I thought wouldn't it be great to like teach a class around this using the actual television series as a text that's and that's exactly what she's doing here at the U of O. Mian's course is centered around teaching Karl um, Marx's theory of urban sort of political economy. So how does a TV show help students learn the theory? Can sort of, once they develop empathy for certain characters, they kind of take them seriously, and it gives them the kind of tools to actually think through a lot of abstract and often difficult concepts. Aidan Smith is a student in the class and finds that the show is a very effective learning tool. But I think it is more effective because this way you can sort of, instead of going to a text or going to a page and sort of reading through something and bringing it up to a group, um, you can actually show them directly. Like, you know, like this action happened and this is, these are the actors involved. The Wire touches on nearly all aspects of Baltimore's infrastructure, from the police to the Port of Baltimore to City Hall to schools and even the press. But how do people who are outside of those institutions, such as the trafficker named the Greek, help teach the material? You go. Be safe. The Greek and the Greeks cartel represent in the show is the globalization of circuits of trade, even illegal and informal circuits of trades. What about what exactly Omar Little? do you do for a living, Mr. Little? I rip and run. You I rob drug dealers. What Omar represents is um, the sort of pirate, I guess, a pirate of capital, um, you know coming in with all of his great one-liners and sort of preying upon illicit and legal organizations, enterprises. But he also troubles our sort of notions of heterosexuality and homosexuality and sort of race and class. Um, he troubles all that stuff. He's a sort of working class person. He's black, he's homosexual, but he doesn't wear being gay on his sleeve. Um, and so he provides a really good thinking tool for a lot of students to kind of trouble these categories of like identity and, and socio-spatial difference. Mian wants to teach the course for about four more years before taking on another frontier where she hopes to teach a political geography class using another HBO show, Deadwood. The Wire is a successful tool, but education is forever changing, and our friend Omar could probably sum it up the best. All in the game, yo. <laughs> All in the game. <laughs> For more about the University of Oregon's geography department, go to geography.uoregon.edu. I'm Eric Gunderson, J432 News.